Um, I am on my patio right now, and um, it's like the fourth. Duh, it's the fourth. Why would I be doing this makeup? I mean, why did I do this makeup if it wasn't the fourth? You know? Um, so I am posting. Oh, I'm sorry. as far as my wire goes, um, my uh, charging wire, so I'm on my patio, and this kind of furniture that we have, like we have this, um, couch, we have two chairs, one table, and they're all, they all have this kind of design, so since it is the fourth, it's a little bit late that I'm doing my favorites, I never really have it on time, so sorry about that. So this is my makeup for 4th July. My dad's actually grilling right now and I can hear the ice cream truck right now and it's playing Silent Night. So obviously it's Christmas in July. I don't know. I'm pretty stupid. <laughs> so I actually am holding all my favorites um, in this box and it's a Route Route, route, route 66 um, box that I got, I mean, someone got shoes, and it was over my grandma's, and I found this box, and I loved it, I fell in love with it, I don't know, but I guess I like boxes, I mean, this one's really cute, and plus it's really sturdy, and this box been over for about five years, I don't even know, so let's just get into this, because I'm blab, you know, blabbing, um, so the first one is my Claire's palette, and it has all these amazing colors, which actually I did my 4th July makeup with this. And um, I'm not going to be filming my 4th July makeup because 4th July is almost over because today is 4th July. And uh, my makeup looks good. Okay. So it has all these really pretty colors, which I absolutely love. You can see the ones that I really used very much. Um, which are the beiges and browns and I actually did a tutorial with this palette only one if I'm gonna let you guys stare at this to see if you guys want a tutorial on anything I can hear fireworks going off right now so it's pretty humid out here so you guys are lucky I'm even doing this <laughs> and the next thing is my blackhead eliminating daily scrub by Neutrogena as I said, I believe in my um, summer sun tag. Um, you can go ahead and check that out, what I said about it. I mean, it's pretty good to get away blackheads. Um, I have used it most of this month, but I started to stop. Um, like in the beginning of the month, I wasn't using this. And then as soon as I started using this, it, um, like after about two weeks or so, um, this started working, and my blackheads are finally gone again, um, yeah. This is the foundation, and it's the 24 Hours Revlon Color Stay Whipped. This stuff does stay on for a long time, and sorry if I don't, I don't know if it's focusing or not, it's so far away. So, this is what it looks like, and it's a medium beige. And I've used this a lot, but I also use my Revlon um, DNA Advantage one, which I really love. The next thing is my ID Minerals um, bronzer, and this is in Norm. And it's pretty orange, as you guys can see. And it doesn't show up orange on your face. It's a lot of fireworks going off. Um, I have it on today and it's not really, as you guys can see, there's not really orange on my face. It blends in pretty good. And I absolutely love this, even though it's orange. Like everybody always is always like, it's orange, I'm not going to buy it because it's orange. And orange should, shouldn't even be a bronzer. but. Fine. The next thing is my moisturizer. This is my Taraka moisturizer and it's a nourishing moisturizer. And 
and it has Sicilian red at one chest box. And um, I got this from Cali Cosmetics, which is bleh, which is C A L I Cosmetics dot com. I don't really say www, but if you guys want to know, it's www.calicosmetics.com. This is what it looks like, and it smells so good. I love this, and I, I, I believe I have this right here now. It smells amazing, and it lasts forever. I have it right here, after a year, and I love it. I hope my camera is fixing it. I believe it is. So, the next thing is also from my summer sun, sun tag. Some of my summer sun tag um, stuff is in here. Um, only because either I couldn't find the stuff again, or some I love more than others. So this is the Garnier Fruit Teas um, Anti-Free Serum in Sleep and Shine. And I use this so many times, as I said, I believe I said that in my summer sun tag video. And I only have, like, that much left. And that is amazing because I, I think I've used this about 50 times already. And, I mean, there's only that much missing. So this is absolutely a great buy. I believe I got this for... This is the tiny one. I believe I got this for eight dollars and there's the big one which is like that big that's probably like ten to thirteen dollars the next thing is my highlighter which I use the wet and wild mega glow and it actually it says you can smooth onto cheeks lips and eyes for a glowing effect with a hint of color this is in toasty and it's pretty brown but it's all right because i mean i also have it on today and you don't see brown on my face or orange as i said um as long as you blend it in really good it's fine but you don't want to blend it really good onto your eyes lips or eyes lips because you want that to pop out you know okay unless you're gonna like just give a glowing effect to your eyes or lips I also have it right here. Okay, next thing is my Maybelline Eye Studio. Sorry, I'm trying to find the perfect spot. This is um, in 40 Green with Envy. It has all these perfect colors. They're beautiful. I don't like the last color because I never liked a black with sparkles in it, unless it's the MAC Black Tide Velvet. Um, I love the green and I love the other two colors, which are the beige, well, the neutrals. I mix those together, put it on the lid, and then I take the green and I put it on the outer corner. Which, I was saying this in my other, I mean, not my other favorite video, I filmed this about ten times, and the first time I seen was that I was like, I would usually put the green in the outer corner, and then I look in the back, and then I have green on the outer corner, and I'm like, oh, thinking alike, huh? And then... So I really like the green because it's elegant, and these are really pigmented, but also smooth, I guess. Like, not all eyeshadows, like some are scruffy, some are, you know, all different. Okay, the next one is this CoverGirl Quad, and this is in Tropical Fusion, and I put these under my um, waterline for, a, like, a pop color. And the most one I used was the orange, and it doesn't look like I used them um, on camera, but I really did. I mean, you don't really take much for, um, sorry, it looks like it's going to rain. You don't really take much eyeshadow for under the eyes, so that's probably why. I mean, I dab it in, and I apply it, and that's all, because these are really pigmented, and I love them. I like the orange and the turquoise. I don't like the green because it's like Shrek green. I don't like Shrek green. I like lime greens and bright greens. Make, like stuff to make you happy. Alright. Sorry, my eyes are like a 
sim of me. This is the instant age rewind eraser for dark circles and it has this kind of applicator and this is an 40 honey and it's pretty dark but I have gone today and it's not that dark as you guys can see because it blends in perfectly. This is a eyeshadow duet and this is from NYC which is New York color and it has this baby pink and dark brown. I actually used the dark brown as a crease color the other day and I forgot how much I love it. Graham! There's a wire! Um, so the baby pink I use the most and yeah. is in Tribeca Toast. I think this is the prettiest duet I have ever seen before. I'm sliding my makeup off. Okay, so this is a Wet n Wild Meta Eyes. I don't know if they sell them anymore, but I've been loving them. And I have a pink, a green, and this one. Which this one is in cream. Two fifty one. Yeah. All right. So I have a favorite mascara. It's three favorite mascara. Mascaras actually. I love the Maybelline Lash Stiletto, which looks like this. I love the Maybelline Define Lash, which looks like. And I love the Revlon Girl Blushes mascara. The Girl Blushes looks like that. It's like a spiral brush. The Defino Lash looks like that. I don't know if you guys can see those. I mean, I can't really see that. I mean, I can see good, but I can't see like small things in my camera. Like I actually have this on today. The next thing is this Cute Body by Cute Kika, and it's an intense lip hair balm. And this is like Carmex, but it's white, as you can see. And it's, I mean, it feels just like Carmex, but it's more thick consistency. Um, yeah. This is L'Oreal. Paris Voluminous Smoldering Eyeliner, and this is in black, and this like swipes right on, as you can see, and I like it. Next thing is a brush, and I know it sounds weird to like a brush, but this is an Echo Tools brush, which looks like this, and it's like a fluffy brush, and it goes like into your crease, as you can see. I mean, it's like a dome brush, actually. Next thing is my OPI Nail Liqueur, and this is in Lucky Lucky Lavender. It's such a pretty color that I... I love it. And the last thing is my Wet n Wild Mega Slicks, and this is in Sweet Glaze, which... It smells really good, though. That's the thing. I never had it like that um, a gloss that smells really good. I mean, I have that were flavored, but these aren't flavored. And the last thing is these glasses, and these are by Magnavision, which I will only wear for a second because I know people don't like glitters. Um, I have apps and shows and music, but, um, the last thing is my Revlon? I don't remember. I think it's a Revlon curling wand. Something like that. I don't remember. Remington? I don't know. I'll tell you guys some other time because I forgot.
they're so far away and I can hear them. Which my Remington, or I think it's Remington, it was, it was special edition in the Christmas time. And I curled my hair today. It's really pretty. I like it. So my favorite shows are Pretty Little Liars and Awkward. My favorite music is Hey Phone by Maroon 5 and One More Night by Maroon 5 and Sail by All One Nation, something like that. And then my favorite apps, which I will show you guys, it's 527. I hear people screaming. Is Instagram and Twitter. Oh, I'm trying to find a good one. Instagram and Twitter and my Tag Swing app and Shazam and Locker and producer of YouTube. I've been loving iMovie as long as I record on here I use iMovie. Um I love YouTube and mail. That's mostly everything. This is a 16 minute video and I've been loving my camera. Does that count? Alright, so I'm gonna come up close because I'll show you guys my makeup. Can you guys see it? Alright, I'm gonna go in because I'm setting shit up and my face is darker. Alright. 